Hey, what's up guys? Professor here. I'm gonna have a tutorial today on how to record in FL Studio specifically with your Blue Yeti mic. I know this is a common purchase, especially amongst people who are like trying to start out with vocals. I know it's not the best and high-end stuff. Uh, I'll go be going over recording with an interface, uh, probably the next audio tutorial. But right now we're gonna stick with the Blue Yeti, how to hook it up, how to use it in FL Studios, and how to take care of the minor issues you're gonna immediately face if you've never dealt with this. All right. So the first thing you're going to need to do, okay, so first you're going to take your Blue Yeti out of the box. It may look different than mine, I just got the Assassin's Creed one, whatever, it doesn't matter, it's still the same thing. Or if it's a USB mic, it doesn't matter. Make sure this thing's plugged into this end. Put your thing on this option right here if you're going to be dealing with things in front of you. Find it all the way at the end. Get the USB and plug it into there. All right. Boom. Now you're set to go. Let's move this out of the way. That's not going to come up for you guys. The second thing you're going to need to do is go here. After you plug in your Blue Yeti microphone to your U one of your USB slots, and then the other end into your Blue Yeti and let it install its drivers, you're going to need to go over here to your speakers icon. Right click it, and then I'm going to need you to click on recording devices. Now, it shouldn't have this as your default yet. Your default is going to be this one. That's going to be whatever microphone you have on your webcam for your computer. You need to click this and then you click set default. So once you click that, your computer will default have this arm for recording, but that's not gonna do everything we need yet. So this will be clicked first. I'm not gonna click it to default because I don't want you guys to hear my voice through that. So you click this, realize that it's Yeti stereo microphone. You see that the little bar is going up and down as I'm talking, set default, apply or okay, just get that. Next thing we're gonna need to do is open up a new project in FL Studios or a pre-existing one. We're going to do a pre-existing one in a moment though, so I can show you guys how to fix some of the details while recording. So you got yourself a new project here, but you notice that like, what the hell's going on? You're going to click this, and you're still not going to see anything going on. So, oh, alright, look, look, you're, you're getting, getting this double thing, thing back out at me. It probably, probably sounds ridiculous. ridiculous. Oh, oh wow, you can, can hear my roommate. roommate. Anyways. Um, okay, so, so this, this isn't doing anything, and I also don't recommend using your master track. Alright, I don't recommend at all using your master track for, uh, for recording vocals. So, what we're going to do here, instead of doing what I just did, which is the last thing you want to do, you don't want this saying record. So, instead, what you're going to do, open up a new track, or a new thing, select a track, that's not really being used yet. Just so you don't have to worry about fucking with the vocal effects. Go here and check which insert your microphone's in. For a Blue Yeti, I believe it's doing stereo at least. You can have it do mono, but you can have it do a front end stereo. So, so as you. you ooh, all, all right. right. So, so you see over here, we, we got, got like almost balanced sound levels. levels. For the, that, that means. Mm, that means it's coming in on a stereo channel left and right. Now, if you want it to be mono, specifically like say you're going to be trying to do some like vocal overs, like some Suicide Boy style, put that on the one channel. All right. Now you're only getting like one. You don't have multiple mics set up anyway, so it doesn't really matter. But say you have an interface with a guitar set up in one and a microphone. Usually you'll see that your microphone's only linked to one of those. Anyways, so we're going to go to set up in, see, stereo or mono. In this case, since it's a Blue Yeti, we're just going to do stereo. Now you'll notice what I did here was I turned that down. This, this is because you're, you're going to be hearing your reverb. Every, every time you try and rap or sing, you're going to be like, yeah, I got, I got it on, on the bit. And that voice stutter effect is going to murder you when you're trying to do things. So to turn that down, what you have to do, click on the track, go to this. This is sending it to the master. You turn this down. Now you could turn it down some of the way or all the way. This is like for voice testing. I turn it down all the way, but as you can see, it's still capturing my voice. So now once you have this arm to record, find a pattern that's not being used. I'm not using pattern one yet. And I'm going to go to record. You can record into Edison if you want to do some heavy editing, 
but I'm gonna do what I normally do is audio into playlist as audio clip. All right, testing out the mic. You can hear it, you can see the volume on screen, you can see the levels. All right, I don't give a dang, that's tight. Ah, ah, now look at that. We got ourselves a nice vocal thing here and we're not gonna record again, so make sure that's not pressed when you wanna test your vocals out. So you're gonna go back and listen. All right, testing out the mic. You can hear it, you can see the volume on screen, you can see the levels, all right. I don't give a dang, that's tight, ah. All right, so that's cool, we got that, sweet. So you figured out how to record with your mic, and if you wanna go back and do it again, boom, just got this, you find a track, find a place in the track where you wanna do it, move that out of the way, boom, 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 go in there again. All right, now we got that done, but let's deal with some of the problems you're gonna be facing when trying to record. Let's open up a project. Um, open. Let's open up. Uh, uh, which one we got here? All right, so we got ourselves a beat. Now let's go over recording on the beat. All right, so you see that I have all these things active. I don't wanna mess with that. So you already have your beat going. You're finally ready to record. New pattern. Name that vocal so you don't get lost. You know, you got your vocals right here. Now open up a new audio clip. Audio clip right there, boom. Color it so you don't forget, you know, change this is my vocal re recording track now when you finish recording it's not going to be on this track but this is just a good way to keep track of where you're going to be doing your stuff i see that 15 is going to be a good place to do since it's not being used well yep okay so i go into i click double click on that go to master or mixer 15 boom now, now i'm getting, getting that, that double, double again. again remember just, just go, go highlight, highlight your, your, your track, track on, on your, your mixer, mixer. Boom. All right. Now, of course, you're going to hear backgrounds and white noise in your stuff, depending on your vocal equipment. If I get myself a pop filter, go into a quiet room with no air conditioning, and then get like a, like a fuzzy setup behind it, your vocals are going to be a lot clearer. Um, but right now, we're just going to stick with the blue Yeti mic in a normal room that someone might have with their laptop. So get my shit ready to record turn off that obnoxious beeping thing though it's perfect for staying on freaking tempo act right, so record audio into playlist as audio clip yeah oh yeah we rolling up in that girl i see an up and that's her i got shit like a pearl Ooh. i got that green in the bag Girl, you looking sad? Why not hang with me and tag? Oh, Khalifa, you know I'm ballin' big. Got the high rise up on the fucker swing. Yeah, we in the hotel, the top floor. We looking down, that city's got money, but we want more. Ah, uh, we smoke the night away. Still, we get in paid. Wake up in the morning. Look, hey, that's new lace, get money, got on that OG, okay, ha. And now we breaking down, got a single round, we off key, but we can edit later. Let's get our generic riser in here. Yeah, oh girl, I want my baby on the rocks, yeah, girl, I want my baby on the rocks. I want my baby on the rocks Yeah girl, we gonna have a good time ah. <laughs> Alright So we got our vocal track there now you know, It's gonna sound goofy, but whatever Yeah Oh yeah, we rolling up in that girl I see an up and that swirl I got the shit like a pearl Ooh. Now you see that this is now coming out of here As I play Yeah Oh yeah, we 
So what I'm gonna wanna do is keep it near my vocal track. I'm gonna put it on 16. I'm also gonna disable this for recording now so I don't run into issues later. Now let's go to 16. And let's solo this so we can listen to it. Well anyways, that's the end of the tutorial if you want to just record, okay, into your FL Studios. I guess from here, I'll release a second tutorial over, how, how long is this video right now? Do we have time to go over it? No. Alright guys, so I'm going to end the tutorial here, and then I'm going to continue it on a, video, a second video, alright, on how to make this recording sound better. Yeah. Oh yeah, we rolling up in that girl. I see an up and I swear I got like getting rid of the getting rid of that white noise, finding the good frequencies, identifying the bad frequencies, making it sound sexy, whatever. But right now, guys, that's the end of this tutorial. Uh, hopefully this helped out with you guys purchasing your blue yeti, working in FL Studios. If you guys have any questions, feel free to leave questions down in the comments. I'd also appreciate if this helped out if you left a like, that would really help out the channel. Um, don't forget to subscribe if you want to see any more tutorials coming out or just information as well as songs. You know, it really helps out. You guys can come back, leave comments, I'll answer your questions. But remember to subscribe, uh, give it a like, leave a comment. You can check out my other channels. And that was Professor, P-R-O-F-E-S-S-O-A-R, -S -S here. I hope you guys have a good day. And we're going to continue this tutorial. Peace.